what a way to start off the video. What did you say today in your Instagram caption? Say it. Carbs say don't it. count on Sundays. <laughs> It's true, and guess what today is? It's Sunday. Why don't they count on Sunday? Uh, because we just made it up. So we're gonna go get some deliciousness. Stay tuned. Don't click off the video, or else you're lame. Just kidding. Go buy a sweatshirt if you're gonna click off. Yeah, go, go buy one. Link in the bio. So like, literally, every spot that we've been to, It's gotten to the point where I've been to In-N-Out so many times that I know what the wait time would be. And we'd probably be there for like a half hour. So if it's not died down by the time we get out of this crazy Taco Bell line, we're out. We're gonna have to think of it. And we got time to brainstorm. A few moments later. This dude's license plate literally says cheeseburger. Oh, <laughs> uh, mad props, dude. He didn't even park. <laughs> he's got he's got the license plate down. He just doesn't have his parking game down. I was hoping to get your toasted cheddar chalupa, please. You guys have your cheesy gordita crunch? Yes, we do. Oh, you guys have that. Cool. Um, let me go ahead and get one of those, please. Can I get one medium diet Pepsi, please? Uh, two sides of your cinnamon twists, and uh, I think that's gonna do it. Mommy's hungry. I'm hungry too. Well, come set your booty down. What's up, everybody? So we'll never forget that craziness. Do we'll you want to make a mimosas and use that juice you bought? Um, let me taste this first. I'm pretty sure we've had this champagne before. It's about to get lit. I don't, I don't know if I've had it ever with you. Hey, hey, hey. we got to be equal here, right? Is that how you do it? I'm confused now. No, you're supposed to, you're, I'm supposed to drink. Oh, right, right, right. Bed. Sensational. What a way to kick off the video. Christy's hungry. Um, and uh, yeah, about that cupcake. I'm probably gonna be having some of that. But welcome to the video, everybody. We're gonna be eating <laughs> our our cravings here. Mmm. Mmm. Get ready for it. I'm gonna I'm gonna make some mimosas. There's nothing like. My what? I know. Well. Yeah, you are making a mess, I as per usual. I already told them that. Hey, it looks like your pee. <laughs> My pee does not look like this. In the morning it does. Your pee in the morning looks like it too. Mm -mm -mm. We're not We're not gonna start this video off like that. Ooh. It's way better than in and out. Can I have some ketchup? Do you want a napkin? I'll be getting up to here soon. Get it. Why don't you go get a napkin? Eric has the longest arms. His nickname that I never call him is Inspector Gadget. Yeah, you've literally never called me that before. In my, in my mind, I think it all the time though. Um, but it's good, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's not gonna be a, a protein style in an out burger, which we could have had. I mean, it's good. I like it. It's the first bite of food I've had today, so I mean, actually no, it's a lie. I had some energy goose on my ride. Um, I mean, it is, but more importantly, I'm so excited because I forgot we got Taco Bell. Oh yeah, we got Taco Bell, babe. I saw cheesy gordita crunch on the menu, and I almost lost my SHIT because I thought they discontinued it. But um, I got us their all new ch Taco Bell Cheddar Chalupas. Now these things, they look, they look sensational. So, and they're chicken too, so, you know. Okay. I got one for Christy and I. So I got you, uh, I got you one. Thank you. Ooh. Well, that's good. Oh, I know, it's because I made it. Color's not very appetizing, but it looks good. Babe, hey, just, you, you have to put it out of your mind. Here we go. I'm not taste anything inside. All I'm getting is bread. 
I got a lot of chicken, that's good. Like that is the inside look of that. Okay, I gotta go try this again. I'm just get to the chicken. Mmm, there's oh, yeah. the chicken. Okay, chicken's good. The chicken's very good. Um, I um, I saw this as a new item and I'm like, you know what, I gotta give them. I gotta try it. We've tried it. Uh, what would you what would you rate that? Um, that's actually pretty good. I would say like a six out of ten. Six out of ten. We're gonna be better with our ratings. Ratings are very important. Whenever we try new things, we always try to get you guys the inside scoop on whether they're they're worth trying or not. No, oh, those are you don't like what's in that bag. Mm. Christy also had to get some sushi over there. I don't know. Can I get into that? Babe, you can literally do can whatever I got you want. Hummus. Whatever you want in the world. I don't have hummus in so long. It's pronounced hummus. Uh-oh. Don't worry. You got it. I actually like this burger that we made. So what are you looking to, looking forward to most for the holidays? For Christmas? To see my sister? That'll be fun. We're gonna be in Texas. We need to get on top of scheduling. Already did. You already scheduled it? Yeah. You didn't. You bought plane tickets and everything? Mm -hmm. No, you didn't. He lies. Yeah, you're right. Um, but yeah, for sure we will. We'll have to get on top of that. I'm thinking about it's kind of a weird it's a weird time for sure because I feel like like we're planning on doing like even for Thanksgiving we're gonna be traveling and did you, did you look into that is the forest open like the we want to go to Yosemite and you know and that we're not even sure if Yosemite is gonna be open because we just got put it back into the purple tier which is not it's one of the it's the, I think it's actually the worst tier to be in and um, we don't. We want to go to San Francisco, and we want to go to Yosemite for for Thanksgiving. I've never been sure. to San Fran. Yeah, and Chrissy's never been, and we want to make sure that like if we do go travel, that we're gonna be able to like, you know, San Francisco is a great food city. That's really like you're gonna have a lot of fun in San Francisco. Well, that would be like super crappy if um, we go there and like all the food places are closed. And yeah, that's why I'm like I don't know if like it's even worth it, you know. Yeah. Going. So, are you, uh... I was gonna put the sodium in here. The soy sauce. The soy sauce, which is just liquid sodium. Um, but on better, better note here, we have the cheesy gordy of the crunch. I was under the impression that they discontinued this, so I'm really happy. If I could let out like a fire emoji, I would. How's your sushi? Good. It's spicy. Well, it is a spicy sushi. What is bowl. what is the spicy part? Is it the red sauce on top of it? I would assume that's what the spicy part is. Creep that off. It's better. It is there's there's like wasabi on that. I'm gonna be the true judge of this. Is there avocado in it? I I just like a teeny tiny piece. Like, you wouldn't even be able to taste it. No, geez. Can't tell. Maybe it's that entire sauce. Mm. That's good. I mean, it's not as good as my cheesy gordita crunch, but. No, I'm sure it's not. Scrape the entire sauce off. You know, the sauce is the best part. Sauce is spicy. Sauce, sauce is put on things for a reason. I'm about to take this up a notch. Fresca. Yep, next level. Are you happy? When Chrissy's stomach is happy, that means everything is good. <laughs> what? I'm kidding. You've had like three bites of food. I know. Are these, are these uh, did Christy have pregnancy cravings? What? That's what everybody's gonna say. 
This is the Cravens video. Oh, this video was not my idea. What was your idea? Your idea. Like all videos are. <laughs> I was about to say. I'm trying, babe. I'm trying. Uh, there are no pregnancy cravings. If we have a child, we are going to name him, because um, I've already determined that it's going to be a boy. We're going to name him um, Tip Tip. Or uh, we're going to name him um, Optimus Prime. <clears throat> Forks. You just, just got to the point where she just doesn't care about what I say anymore. No, we don't have any forks. Babe. I brought them over here. What'd you do with them? Knew it. Uh, we're going to be uh, Optimus is going to be uh, a very what you call strong. Opie? What? Opie. Oh no no no! It would be it would be his full name. His only name would be Optimus. Whether you like it or not, that's just that's just the way it would. So why we're not having kids? The thought of having kids like traumatizes me. Why does it traumatize you? Just the thought of it. Oh, just from like the actual like birthing standpoint? No, the entire process. Oh, oh yeah. Well, we were talking, why were we talking about this earlier? We got in the car and Christy was like, if you have a kid, it's like 18 years to life. And it's cause I'm on my period. And I said, that's a better sacrifice than having a kid. I was so you were trying to touch me appropriately, inappropriately. Oh, yeah, and she told me she was ret retreated. She always, you, she, you actually don't say that anymore. You used to say it, I'm retreated. And guys, if you're listening out there or if you're watching and your girl tells you that she is retreated, you need to take that and you need to understand what she's saying. No girl ever says that. I heard that on a, it was, it was breaking down. We don't need to talk about this, Never mind. Babe, it's 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 life. It's the circle of life. It's not a big deal. Okay. Well, I was reading a thing where it explains the energy levels in each phase of a month of a woman, and in this phase, the menstruating phase, um, she is considered retreated. Like she has a retreated. Oh yeah. She like yeah. kind of in in to herself and is is very low energy and very fatigued and. It's just how it goes. So Chrissy's retreated. I'm retreated. What? Oh, I'm sure she does. Keep her warm. Babe. But I'd be really good with hummus. Good. What I do know about is that these are the best one. Okay, every time I say the best, people actually think that. Eric, it's literal. It's literal. Eric has a lot of the best. Yes, I have a lot of, um, I'm all over the place. Do you get annoyed when people are like, Eric, what is your favorite food? Babe, I've been asked that question so many times. I know. I, know I have a lot of favorite foods. I also have a lot of foods that I won't eat anymore like and because what? of what I do for a living. What? Like what? <clears throat> chili. I love chili. Why would you eat chili? Um, I did. Canadian challenge? Uh, no, that was poutine. Oh. Um, that's another food that I refuse to, uh, to touch. Um, I did a chili contest. I didn't know that. I've done many chili contests. It was, it was just horrible. I don't even want to think about it. But um, but yeah, that's that. But anyways, that's chili. Oh, chili. So when, when we did our food supply, you bought like massive cans of chili. Why would you do that? I don't know. <laughs> okay, chili during the fall time. Have you ever had a chili dog? Chili dogs are the best. Another thing I hate, hot dogs. Yeah, I, I can understand that. So really quick, we were in Walmart. I've never seen this before. Let's show them the brand. This is Helados Nita. This is in Walmart. So we found this and Christy um, was very curious about trying it. And so um, we're gonna try it for you guys. That is very good. That's a very good vanilla. Sometimes. Just like vanilla. 
good. And sometimes plain vanilla ice cream is like. We're eating, yes, yes, we're eating ice cream with a fork. There's sushi sauce on that fork. There's no more sushi sauce. <clears throat> It may just because I'm mildly intoxicated, but I don't taste any difference between normal vanilla ice cream. Mm. Mexican vanilla extract. It does taste different. Have you ever used Mexican vanilla? Mm -mm. There, it's different. It's like much more, I don't know, rich, I guess. I don't know. Rich? Yeah. I also got some Halo Top because Halo as Top much as I've, I've dogged on Halo Top, actually, I don't think I've ever actually like said anything bad about Halo Top because they've always just been super consistent. Apart from their dairy-free pints. Dairy, I accidentally grabbed a dairy-free pint and I was like, what in the world is this? And the only thing about Halo Top is I like, I know my gas is super bad the day after. No. Why? I don't know. I think it's just the sweetener that they use. Hmm. Um, but um, yeah, you can never go with the OG strawberry. You can never go wrong with you mean? Go wrong. Babe, it's just blame it on the champagne. Everything, whenever you say stupid stuff and you're drinking, we wanted to get into this cookie right here. So by the time that you guys see this, these cookies will have already been launched. But the thing is, is you guys gotta go get some because um, they will be out for the holidays. This is the Fat and Weird Cookies apple cider cookie. And I'm extremely excited to try this out. I've waited my whole life for this. Um, Why? What kind of cookie is it? Um, it's an apple cider cookie. Oh, apple cider cookie. Um, so I'm gonna break this just like so. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> we got some caramel action. Do you want more caramel or do you want less caramel? More caramel. Teens just like sits here and then she just gives up. I know. Teens? No. Right, here we go. Don't come back. Oh, go. I mean, I'll give her a piece here in a second. Babe. Okay, let's go. Ooh, there's like something back here too. Holy crap. Woo! That is sensational. We got gingerbread. I got some gingerbread in there. And you... Gingerbread. There's like cloves or um, something in that. Goodness gracious. That was very rich. I, I think I got that entire thing of caramel. Wow. And of course, if you guys want to get some fat weird cookie, link is down below. You guys can get 10% off if you use electric at checkout. We love fat weird cookie around here. Yeah, their big booty dough is really good too. Definitely got into that. They have protein cookie butter, which is out of this world delicious. Stick it in the fridge. Yeah, you're weird for doing that. I feel like you, whenever I have food items, you do, you're like. Well, bring it back, I was eating it. It's more convenient when it's closer to me. That I can understand. So, if we do end up going to San Francisco, of course we'll be doing a food the food adventures there. But if you guys live in San Francisco, San Francisco, I can't even say it. If you guys live there, let us know what you guys think we should do. <clears throat> and if it's open, let us know. I mean, Yosemite's open. Um, I mean, it's a national park. Like there's no like. You never know. Yeah, I guess we do live in California. Um, all right. Let's give me this brownie brittle right here. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm very excited about this. So is this the gingerbread one? Mm-hmm. Pulling the air water. I asked, I was, it was between salted caramel and this. Okay. This, this is gonna suck compared to the cookie we just had. Maybe not. Okay. That was good. Not like melts in your mouth. That's what she said. It's good. I'm gonna follow that up with some uh, Mexican ice cream. And I can actually say that, okay, because it says Mexican vanilla. Some people. And it says it on the in ingredients. That's what they use. I feel it. like there's certain terminology and words that people are be like, 
Oh, you can't say that. It's not politically correct. Ooh, yeah, I'm very excited about those. those are big cups. So, no, 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 they're not just big cups. They're big Reese's cups with pretzels on the inside. Big cups with pretzels on the inside. Okay, let's see if it's worth it. Oh my oh, yeah, god. Good. Oh my god. Woo! Like, I can't even Holy believe. Holy crap, that's sweet. Oh, it's good. That's like really good to have like a hard crunch. That is everything I've been waiting for. Everything I've been waiting for. Wow. So dramatic. Oh my gosh. That is the best Reese's I've had in years. Yeah, I, I have to agree, especially all the Halloween candy we just like, had. That is by far the best. You have, it's not even just the crunch, it's this. It's the saltiness within the Reese's. Because she's going to go back to her sushi. Those are really good though. Recommend. Put them in a stocking. I'm going to chase that with some um, cinnamon twists. I don't twist. really love you if you do that. What? I don't want the sushi sauce. What if we just sat here for like an entire like hour and just like didn't say anything and just ate? Didn't you say you've got an hour to eat the rest of this? Yeah, we've been here for about an hour. No, we haven't. The hour started when we um got in the car and drove to go get everything. Yeah. Okay, that works. Okay, I'm full. Oh look, Twix. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, Twix. I can't open it. I'm pretty sure we've had the Twix on this channel. I probably. We've eaten so much food on this channel. This is the Twix cookies and cream. Cookies and cream is like such a great candy bar. It's second to caramel. That's good. I'm gonna chase that with some uh, Helados de Nita. They had a horchata flavor. Yeah, you didn't want it. I remember trying that one time as a drink and being like- Horchata is really good. What is it? Like sweet milk, isn't it? Pretty or much. Or rice, I don't know. You just need to have the right horchata. Um, I think that we've polished off pretty much everything. Minus that. This is mine. I chose this cupcake. Anyways, folks, if you guys enjoyed this video with us, be sure, to, be sure to let us know down in the comments below. Let us know what you guys want to see for the holidays because we have a lot of ideas, but we want to hear from you guys. Are there any specific things you want to do besides the gingerbread? Um, you mean food-wise or just to do? I want to drive around and look at light if people are festive. Yeah, if we can do that, we'll do that. And then it's my birthday. Chrissy's gonna be 21. I know. Well, 22, because we were just ready to go. I'm gonna be 22. 22. <clears throat> it's crazy. Um, what, I look people, like I could be 22. Then people are gonna be like, oh my gosh, she's actually turning 22? Yeah, let them believe it. Okay, for sure. Anyways, let us know what you guys want to see for the uh, the holidays and just in general. What? That is like three quarters frosting. Babe, I rode my bike 120 miles today. Holy I don't need any sass right now. Do you want some ice cream on that? Nope. Okay. Anyways, folks, we love you guys very much. Like the video if you like it and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Without further ado, the electrics. We're out. You mad? I was hoping you were going to take a bite of it. <laughs>